Today, let's see how we can use map method with optional class. So first of all, we are invoking a method fetch by salary where we are going to provide a salary. Now we are not sure whether it is going to provide an employee with this salary or not. Hence, we are saving it as optional and we are printing the same. Then in the output, we are saying if present or else. So if the employee is available, we are going to print the details. If employee is not available, we are going to say no employee found. But the trick is that I just want to print name of the employee if employee is available. So one option is I can change this is out condition and I can say only print the name. But another option is I can make usage of map method. Let's see how it is going to work. So first of all, we are going to say here map, which is going to look something like this. And within this, we can say in this particular way, e dot get and then let's say here e dot get name. If you wish, you can make usage of method reference also for this particular one. So let me execute this. So on executing, you can see that currently it is printing the name of the employee as Priya. Now let me change the salary as 13. And now let's see what it is going to do. So in this case, when I say here 13, then it is going to say Priyanka. Now let me make it as 11 and then let's see what it will do. So for 11, since we don't have an employee in the optional object, it is going to say no employee found. So hence we can see this way map method can work with the optional class. Do like the video if you learned something new today. Thank you.